Hello everybody and welcome to this channel once again. Thanks so much for clicking on this video. So if you are new here, please hit on the subscribe button to subscribe. If you are old here, thanks so much for coming back again. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to swap two faces using the layer mask button. So without further ado, let's have fun. Alright, so you are going to need two pictures of which I have Cristiano Ronaldo and Messi over here. So I'm going to place Ronaldo's picture on Messi's picture and then we're going to blend the two so one will have the face and one will have the body and that stuff so you can try that with your own pictures two of your pictures or two of or your picture and a celebrity one of your favorite celebrities picture so let's see how we go about this first I'll place Ronaldo's picture just like I said on Messi's picture so this layer has to be on top like this, just like have it over here. So Ronaldo's own is layer one, and then Messi's own is layer two. Okay, so I will decrease the opacity of Ronaldo's picture, and then I'll make sure that I have his eyes around this place, around the place of Messi, like Messi's eye. So okay. So I'll make sure that I have it over here. So you take your time to adjust the settings like that. And then you can open it up and see. So, okay. Here is okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn off the opacity completely. And then I'm going to activate the layer mask from here. Okay, so go and pick a brush to make sure that you have the foreground color to black. And then decrease the opacity, the hardness, sorry, to 0%. Afterwards, with the layer mask selected, brush of Ronaldo's hair or Messi's hair, any of them. But we just want to have Ronaldo's hair off. So if you turn the opacity on like this, you can see that we are having his hair off, right? Okay, so let's continue doing that. And then we'll get rid of all these places. Okay, so get rid of all these places and then you come to this side and then you get rid of all these places also. Okay, so once you are done with that, you can turn on the opacity to see what you have so far. And then you can see that this place is not looking nice. So you go back and you change the foreground color to white, white like here, and then you select the layer mask still with a brush tool, and then you can brush that place on again. So you have it's like this. Okay, so we don't want Ronaldo's neck, and we only need the mouth, the nose, and the eyes also. So we're going to select the mask again, change it to the color to black again and then we're going to get rid of this body so from here we're going to get rid of all this place and then get rid of all this place so you can decrease your brush by right clicking and decreasing the size and then you go and brush like that so you can take your time to make some funny editing yourself. Okay. So if I have it up to here, I think that will be okay because I have Ronaldo's and Messi's picture blended from here. Okay. So once I'm done like this, I'll go ahead and select Ronaldo's picture. And then I'll go to image adjustment and then hue and saturation and I'm going to bring Ronaldo's image his saturation down small so that I can blend with that of Messi's okay so afterwards let's turn Ronaldo's picture off like this and we have Messi's and if we turn this one back on we have um, Ronaldo and Messi so the body belongs to Messi and the face belongs to 
Ronaldo. So let's turn it on fully like this. And we are done. So that is the simplest way of swapping two pages or blending two pages together in Photoshop. I hope this was helpful. If it was, I hope you give it a like and don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials. Don't forget also to watch other videos of mine because I've got some interesting videos that you need to watch. Thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.